so I am headed home on this beautiful work week. Kids are just getting back to school and we are trying uh, to do a new chore list in our house. So uh, we've had it for a couple of years, but each year as the kids get older and um, you know are able to do a little bit more, we try to up the ante and increase some of their responsibilities and um, we have a new chore list. So we have a two week trial period and then after that it's going to be game on for the kids. So um, by the time I come home, they're already supposed to be started with homework supposed to be done, snack is already supposed to be done. They, they even have a 30 minute break built in where they should have been chilling and relaxing and then they're supposed to get to their uh, chores. But it is almost five o'clock me getting home. The last kiddo gets home at four and I bet that they are not anywhere close, but it's okay. I mean, we, we're really trying this two week thing out to really get them to form good habits in doing it. But I'm just curious to see where they're at as I back into the garage, get out the garage and, and look through the house and see where their rooms and everything are at. So I think I'm going to do that and then I'll, I guess I'll explain a little bit about my um, our chore board and hopefully it'll help, you know, bless other families or at least help other families possibly get organized. Uh, but show you what I got. Pay attention so I don't hit nothing. I got a couple more inches. There we go. All right. Cool. All right. So let's see where these kids see what these kids are up to. And I'm gonna I'm gonna surprise them because they're always talking about being on YouTube or wanting to be on YouTube and all that stuff. Um, probably not in this format, so we shall see how it goes. Oh, I guess let me. All right. Let's come home and put the car on the charger so that's good to go in case I need to go somewhere else the moment of truth hey bud hello guys how to do today <laughs> no you guys always talk about being on camera let's leave your room so you can let everybody yeah. see how messy your room is let's let the world see so by this time, of course, typical boy room, maybe I'll show a video of him actually cleaning it up because it's supposed to be clean. It was clean last night, but he never keeps his room clean more than a day yet. There goes Ava. Say hey, Ava. And there goes Coco. Who's that? Oh, Who's that? Who's that? It's nobody right now. I'm taping you for her YouTube. Ava, um. So we're going to go through your rooms. Ava, Ava's fish died in her <laughs> What, Coco? Sorry, baby. Come here, Coco. Coco! Ava, be careful. Come here, Coco. <laughs> Typical boys' bathroom. We actually switched rooms with the kids. So, our oldest was on this side of the house. And we decided as the girls were getting older, we put them on the same side of the house and put my son over here. And he's supposed to be taking care of all this stuff. What, Coco? What? Come here. Come here. How was school today? Good. Okay, put Coco down. Okay, so there's my little command center that I created for the kiddos. <laughs> really, Ava? Okay, let's go see. I know, but so for it to be Sunday, Sunday is their relaxed day, supposedly. And they're supposed to get back to their chores on Monday. So to be a Monday and coming back, the house doesn't look too bad. Let me see. See what the kitchen don't look, kitchen don't look too bad. Not too bad to be a Monday. Coco, stop, stop. Kevin. 
Kaden, stop messing with the dog. Come here, Coco. Calm down. Calm down. Come on, let's go look. So this is the girl side. Not too bad. You guys look stuff look pretty good. You kept, you kept it keeping it up. Now let's see this this craziness. You okay? You just hit your toe, didn't you? Goodness, baby, where's your? Where are you supposed to be doing your homework at? Oh. On the on the table. But yeah, Ava's room is supposed to be clean as well, but it's a little crazy. But look at my fish. I'm I'm not. People don't want to see the dead fish. Yeah. Rest in peace, fishy. I know he died today. He probably been dead. You didn't even pay attention to him. No, he wasn't. I fed him yesterday. Was he down at the bottom of the thing like that, or was he no, up? No, he was up. Okay. Eating his food, and then he just died the next day. What are you doing? Oh. So. Go. Yeah! This is the oldest. <laughs> so again, we switched the rooms with Nayla and Kaden. So the oldest and the middle child switched rooms. So we got touch up these rooms, get her a bed eventually, but this is what we working with. So as I'm trying to set up to show you guys our vision board and the kids are getting everything crazy, what do I notice? Notice dog poop in the house, which is really not cool. You said what? You got to cleanse that. That's disgusting. I got a what? Cleanse it. Censor, you mean? Yeah, censor. No, it's you guys' responsibility. So all the kids, Part of the chore board is the dog being a responsibility, and no, obviously somebody was not on their job because the dog got pooped there. But all their responsibility to clean it up. So let's get it up. Come on, guys. Ava, go get the vacuum cleaner and go get the baking powder, the uh, the baking soda, and the cleaner so we can clean this and sweep it all up. Come on, shit. Let's go. No, thank you, baby. No, go put that away. Go put that up. Come on, Kaden. Go put Coco near her cake, put her on her can chain and everything so we can get this cleaned up. Let's go, right now. Daddy, Kaden can scrub it and stuff, and then, um, and then I can just put the baby soap on. I got baby soap. Um, so this is our vision board that we tried to create to do something new for the kiddos. Um, it has, it's taking it to the next level, as I mentioned before, but they have a chore list and an after school rule list. And we just kind of broke it down for a pass and fail just to see how things go. Um, and then they have some after school rules that they're supposed to take care of. So they get kind of a, a grade for doing their chores and get everything done during the week and then getting their after school stuff done as well. So it seems like it may be a lot, but I, have been teaching my kids how to clean for a while now since they was little, so it shouldn't be a big. It's not a big issue for them, right? Y'all good. Well, you taught me when I was like seven. You said little. Well, I no, was little. you wasn't that little. You were doing vacuuming and stuff when you were. Well, yeah, because I wanted to learn. I was exactly. like, teaching. Exactly. So that's, that's still chores. Because it looks so fun, but now it's boring, and I never. Okay, so so this is how it's broken down. I found an awesome um layout on pinterest that kind of gave me this idea which is pretty cool it's um really just taking post-it notes and running them through the printer and when you run through the printer it actually has a to-do list that can actually be taken off of your board so all the kids have their sheets that they can do it's pretty cool and it's broken down by kind of just each week still kind of working out some of the kinks of it but in short they have each kid has a color and this is theirs for the week. They're supposed to go by and look at their details of their chores. And then the color one each day, every kid has a color and it coincides with the day and that says who has the dog. So yeah, blue, yellow, I mean pink, yellow, and blue for the dog. So we've been working it out so far so good. What do you guys think thus far of the new chore list? Does it make sense for you guys to easily look at it and stuff? It's your feedback.
Now you'll have nothing to say. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, it's okay, but I just don't like chores. Clearly, well, the kid <laughs> likes chores. Um, oh, keep in mind, Kaden, come come here. You and Nayla, make sure you got you guys are switching this week on our test week. So now you have the kitchen. Kaden's understood. Excuse me, sir. What'd you say? Yeah, so they got bathrooms because each of them have bathrooms. They got the bedrooms, kitchen responsibilities. Everybody has something to do. Rotate in the kitchen. Our family room, trash, and then laundry. We're trying to get that done on Sunday to get everything prepped for the school week. Saturday, actually, no, we tried to get everything done on Saturday, right? So that we have Sunday yeah. to relax to relax after church. We don't have to be doing too much. So that's what it is. That's what our vision board looks like. So we're gonna use this guys as a test one because I don't wanna mess up all the other ones you guys have. This is your test again for this week. So the only thing that should be different is the bathroom is getting swapped. Not bathroom, kitchen is getting swapped for Nayla and Cadence, okay? Yay. So Nayla has the kitchen this week. Kaden, you have the opposite responsibility, which is all the floors this week. Okay, but. Here's our vision board. And then up here is just, we just put different notes and stuff in. Um, we had our, our, our phone numbers and stuff. The kids know those by heart. We have the after school rules posted up here, which now we put in um, on paper. But any other notes we may have as they enter in the sports season and stuff, uh, little notes and stuff we'll try to put here to make sure we're all on the same page. And um, that's holds their folders. So that is our vision board. And uh, yeah, till next time, I guess that's it for now. So.